Alright, so the purpose of this video is to demonstrate a few uh, tips and tricks to deal with stabilizing. Um, those of you who watched the Empire Strikes Back one uh, will remember that all I did was go to here and choose Auto Stabilize and it stabilized the footage nicely. Let's see if it works here today. Well, it looks more jumpy to me. Yeah, it's more jumpy. You see that? So, that's not possible. Um, so the auto stabilize isn't going to work for us here. We could try using a mask. Let's try that. We're going to draw a rectangle around the bit that we really want to stabilize. And we'll see if that fixes it. I bet you're wondering which side is the before and which side is the after. Because they're both jumping around, but the A is jumping around more. And the A is the after. So, automatic stabilization clearly isn't going to work here. It's actually worse than no stabilization at all. So, let's delete that and we'll try some manual stabilization. Stabilize right there. Okay. Now again, let's just toggle that off for a second. We will use our just the default. We will say this is a good target frame. Go. All right. Let's take a look at that. Woo. Well, that's clearly not better, is it? So again, it's clearly it's trying to stabilize to the soundtrack over here. So if we turn the mask back on, so we're only stabilizing the middle again, maybe that'll make a difference. Mm, no. Still looks off. So here's what we're going to do. We are going to reset all the stabilization stuff here. We're going to delete this mask because we don't actually need it. And we're going to try something a little different. In fact, let's just delete this whole effect and add it back again. All right, so this time we're going to say this is a good target frame. We're going to say lock motion. We're going to add an area and we're going to draw it around the A. I'm going to add another area around production, another area around Lucasfilm, and another area around Limited. Now, this time it should work a little better, but still not perfectly. Wait and see what happens. much better see now it's nicely stabilized oh but now it's happening so it's good right up until the end see much more stable exactly what we want except for when the words fade away. So 
How do we prevent that? Well, I'll show you. What we need to do is look and see when the words fade out. Okay, so when does it start to drift? Well, it doesn't seem to start to drift when you do it like that. Okay, well, we're going to say it fades out at frame 176. So we click on ROI, we don't know what that stands for. We're going to say the in is zero and the out is 176. Just do that right there. Now it's zero to 176. Okay. Turn that off. And now, play it again. We finally, oh, no, it's still wobbled. Where does it wobble? Right there. Okay. So we're going to say frame 174. Okay. Turn that off again. Much better. So that's the tip of the day, how to stabilize titles just like this one. Thanks for watching.